it's going to pull water out of your organs and that's where you run into issues of you know pulling too much water out what's up everyone sarmacist russo your favorite all natural athlete you're gonna add like gong sounds or something today i'm going to be going into the number one water pill that anyone can get. You can find this in any fucking Walmart, right? The Durex, the period bloat removal pills. Or if you're the bloat lord like me and you are holding eight pounds of water retention, Austin, from MK677, any sort of um, insulin fucking issue as far as pancreas not working, you having high fasting blood glucose, more water gain, way too many carbs in the system, you wanna get water under control, you're on a wet cycle with Dianabol with a lot of estrogen conversion, anything revolving around, I have too much water retention on my body, too much water retention on my body equals elevated blood pressure, equals elevated risk of heart attack and stroke, more pressure on your kidneys, and overall you feel like shit. So number one, you can obviously go to the sauna, right? That's why I have an LA Fitness membership. Pretty much the only reason right now is because I haven't bought my own fucking sauna from my house. Now we can make arguments about saunas causing infertility and lowering sperm count. I'm trying to pull water off my body, right? So I don't want to have all this water sitting and putting on pressure on my heart and raising my blood pressure. The other way is diuretics, right? Diuretics, you can normally look at the one that's thrown around in the bodybuilding community called diazide. Diazide, super powerful, Austin, right? Austin, if you take too much diazide, it doesn't care. It's going to pull water out of your organs, and that's where you run into issues of, you know, pulling too much water out, throwing off potassium, Literally, your potassium is responsible for your you know, electric signals in the muscles, which you can see bodybuilders fall over on stage and shit. So definitely don't want to be popping diazides all the time unless you're in a contest prep situation. But Durex is a blow removal pill for girls with periods with the um, active ingredient. So this is marketed as a pain reliever, which is why I was like, what? I never read that it was marketed marketed towards that, but N Saeed. So you can see it right here if you guys want to view it. So I will pop two of these if I'm super bloated. I will pound water after. So the key, right, you want to drink tons of water with diuretics. So you're telling your body, ah, 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 there's too much water. I have to get rid of water. Boom, you add in the Durex. It's going to make you piss even more. Then you go in the sauna, drop five pounds of water, your blood pressure goes down, you overall feel better, your face looks better, it doesn't look like a bloated sack of shit, and overall you are harm mitigating any wet steroid, wet SARM, GH related problems of not balancing blood glucose, or any estrogen related issues causing water retention as well. You are combating the water the main at the end of the cascade, the side effect, the water, right? You're not focusing on what's actually causing it, the root problem, but you're buying yourself some time of comfort by not having all this water carrying it around. It's not good. It's unhealthy as fuck. Ask any bloated power lifter. I'll have Austin pull up Mark Smelly Bell. Mark Smelly Bell, super famous power lifter. He was the goat of bloat, right? He broke all sorts of records. Show Mark back then, Austin, and then show Mark now. I guarantee you Mark feels better with the water retention off him. This is an easy way where I don't make no money selling, no commission, no nothing. I will say, here comes the plug, that Enhanced makes a product that competes against this with dandelion leaf, but this is more powerful in my opinion. I normally go to these more. I don't make any money going to Walmart and buying these, but this is in my pharmacy arsenal to combat water retention. Dandelion leaf being another powerful natural diuretic. Stay away from the pharmaceutical diuretics 
unless you have a coach, a doctor, a guru, those are very dangerous. I've used those before. The amount of water I piss out, I'm like, holy fuck with those. These are mild, right? You should be combating the root cause of what's causing all the water retention. This is buying you time and relieving that pressure. That's why it's a pain relief, right, Austin? So I hope you learned something from this video. If you did, please subscribe, click the bell, and check out the rest of my videos. This is a Shadow Band channel, so be sure to follow me on other social medias. I hope you have a great day. I will see you guys in my next video.